Welcome back everybody to the non-serious gaming series playing more Bubble Bubble for Arcade So, look at this Let's see the cheats for this game And look at the message that is first displayed This game has a lot of cheats Don't go mad if it might spoil the game too much Yes, look at the amount of fucking things You can get all the letters, all the items, you can... And... Wait a minute Look these two cheats are useful when you get stuck on a screen, which is pretty much what I had in mind more than once. And are useful, okay, only, use only one at a time. So you can either kill them all right now, drown them all, I think that's an official thing, and throw the book at them now, which is apparently another item that kills pretty much everybody on the screen, and will allow you to move on, which is actually pretty convenient. So, we were going to be starting from level 55. Oops. Fucked it up. Yeah, this is the map thingy. That I told you at the beginning. I guess that was uh, properly registered. If not, I guess I'll do it again. Oh, did I fuck it up? Yeah, because I needed to like select the thing when it's about to start. Like now. Not before I put the credit. But after that. I really have the infinite lives, so let's begin. No, these are not enemies for level 55. Oh, I broke the game a little bit, right? Well, I guess it will get back to normal. Or maybe the difficulty drops because I use this level as a starting one? I really don't think so. I, go I don't think that's intended to be a thing. I guess now it's gonna become... ...difficult. Right, it has a bit... <coughs> Damn it! It has a little bit of everything. Yeah, it, it, and speaking, we're gonna be more demanding with the time too. Okay. Nothing was eventually going to happen. Wait, what? Why is it displaying the hurry up message twice? That was some triple kill. Alright, there's something wrong about this. Probably the cheat fucked their ball up. Oh, there's another enemy still. There we go. Yeah, it started a little bit easier. Pretty sure I already played this level before for some strange reason. We need to see those guys that throw bottles. Okay. There it is. All wishes come true, it looks like. But I think now the game got back to normal. Again, we can actually skip levels in general by taking warps. I think that's a thing. I don't know what item exactly does that, but you can actually skip levels. So if we end up playing a couple levels which are not supposed to be like that in terms of difficulty, because these enemies are extremely simple, probably need to f face other enemies instead. Or maybe just the difficulty dropped, you never know. But yeah, I mean, if this is not how the level is supposed to be originally, probably won't matter too much because it's basically like skipping levels and in the end, of course, it will become difficult anyway. What is that? BR10? Where are the bubbles moving th this fast? I wanna know. Can I pop any? Yeah. Here he comes. So there are a few enemies down here that I don't think they're gonna get up here, so I guess I have to go down myself. Whoa, that was pretty good. I still need to take care of this one. Well, I'm pop the other one. God damn it. 
Was that a double kill? No. Too optimistic. But, I don't know, I've been making steady progress. I mean, this is the fifth level I'm gonna be playing now. Oh, the Space Invaders. Yeah, from level 60 they start featuring the Space Invaders. I, I know that much. So this is the, the, the way it's supposed to be. Alright, that was a massive kill. And now let's wait for the last one. So yeah, they make a Space Invaders uh, tribute in this game. Remember Space Invaders? It's a Taito game. And, well, I guess the big property that they have is that they can shoot downwards. As opposed to the others. Other enemies that were shooting mostly sideways. So I'll be able to kill like one at a time. I'm gonna get killed all the time now. And there's no much you can do other than just waiting. Another death. Couldn't kill a single one with invisibility frames. I guess I'll wait here. That's enough. Okay, things haven't been too complicated. You know, look at these enemies. I would like to test the cheat with the, for example, drown them all. Oh, the drown. Okay, I, I, this is the item that I got at some point during the playthrough. Do you guys remember? Um, let's test it out. Nice. I'm just gonna be skipping a couple levels like that. I mean, I don't have to play entirely all of the levels, right? And... Well, more Space Invaders. Again, that's gonna be the thing. And since I don't wanna... Well, I died. Throw the book. So yeah, by grabbing a book, you kill everybody with a little bit of an earthquake involved. That would have been so difficult, actually, if I had to do it manually. Jump on bubbles, get to the very top, die a lot of times. So yeah, I, I saved some effort. Points. These are not water bubbles. Okay, where can I go to kill these guys safely? I'm not safe here. Well, they shoot downwards. So if you are, if they're in the same platform as myself, well, there were bu uh, water bubbles in the end. Uh, I guess that would make it easier. If they are above me, I'm pretty much fucked. Let's see how they move. Of course, bottles and fireballs together. Alright, one at a time. I guess it's fine for now. Yeah, but there is other hazards in, on the way. I popped it, yes. So it's way for... Okay. I should probably move to the middle myself, instead of waiting for somebody. Oh, come on. No range at all. There we go. One less. That was a good dodge, but I ran out of time. Wait, that was another good kill. Yes! That was pretty nice. That was pretty nice, indeed. Alright, what is that, a flower? First death, I mean first kill. Haven't died yet. Let's uh, pop the fire once, of course. Okay, pretty nice set of levels so far. I think the difficulty decreased after level 50. That's why in the last couple parts I've been making a shit ton of progress. Okay, now I'm kind of stuck. How can I do this? Wait for the guys. I can still make it over there. Probably gonna end up dying, but... It's difficult to... No, let's not abuse the book thingy, or the drowning thingy. I don't know how to make it to the other side, that's a very good question actually, very valid one. How can I make it to the other side? Can I move right? They won't let me, because the blocks are there. Okay, maybe this is how. Alright. Nice. 
Again, I'll be abusing the book and the drowning a lot more often than you think. Okay, I think this is a good point for me to end it. I know I was showing you the cheats at the beginning, but I wasn't expecting to make this much progress, to be honest. Okay, let's finish the part with this one level, though. I'm already on it. Kill him! Oh, alright. Couldn't kill the ball. But... What is that, a potion? I don't think I'll be able to reach that, whatever that is. Wait, last enemy? Oh yeah, I, I think I popped a few fire ones, that's why I killed the majority of the enemies at once, I didn't even notice. So yeah, on to level 68. The lucky number is coming next time though.